can bring an instant change. Basically, they say our mind, our brain and our body is connected. Our mind and our body is connected. It means that if I'm having a stressful and fearful thoughts in my mind, it is going to affect my body as well. That is the reason that sometimes you feel like that under intense depression, fear, our digestive system get disturbed because our mind and body is interconnected. So what is the way they say if we are having, for example, a person who is being in a fearful and a sad state, you know, whenever we are being in the sad state, what type of body posture we take? Imagine about visualize yourself or someone else when you are being in the heightened of that worry, how your body body converge, how you sit, what posture you take, where your where your face goes, how you where your shoulders go. So basically, in order to get a sadness, you have to attain certain posture. You cannot feel sadness while you are being jumping around. You cannot feel sad because in order to get sadness, you have to go into certain physiology. Now, want to instantly change your change your emotions because mind and body is connected. And if you feel sad over here, if you feel depressed over here, change your physiology. And what, what is the way you can change your physiology? So, for example, instantly, if you stood up, if you move around, if you you might have seen that when you are being running around, when you are being going for some sort of exercise and things like that, mind cannot hold two emotions at the same time. Mind cannot think about a pink elephant while you have been th uh, thinking about your goals as well. You always have one thought at the moment. So the psychologists give us that clue that if you want to come out of the fear state or your emotions are controlling your physiology, if you can change your physiology, you can change your emotions as well. Whenever we are having a feeling of loss, what exactly has been happening? Our, our emotional brain is having that feeling of fear and whenever we are talking about that fear is a is a feeling of that loss but if we change those emotions and if we change the antidote of it which is exactly that the thing which you are being blessed with our physiology and our conditions change that's why it is said that whenever you are being in certain down state never remain in the same state even in our even in our, uh, our religious teaching it has been said if you are being in a state of anger, you know now why they say you change your state. If you are standing, you have to sit down. If you are sitting down, you might have to lay, lie down. If you if if you you can drink some water, you can move around. Why it is said? Because if you will change your state, your emotion change. 